this is an Android Wear smartwatch, but it's not an ordinary Android Wear smartwatch. This is the Tag Heuer Connected Modular 45, and it's the second watch from Tag Heuer that runs Android Wear. We saw the Carrera Connected last year, but this time it comes with a whole host of changes and new features that make it quite possibly the most exciting and most Swiss-like Android Wear watch you'll ever see. So this version here is in blue, as you can see, and a blue bezel around the screen. There are lots of different combinations because of the watch's modularity, which we'll see later on. You can take bits of this apart and replace it with other bits from the horns to the straps to the buckle and to the face itself. You can even buy a mechanical face and change the entire watch into a mechanical watch keeping the same horns and the same strap. Android Wear 2.0 is the operating system on here and inside is an Intel processor. It's the same chip that Intel would put in a smartphone. So it's pretty powerful stuff. Now, when Tag Heuer released the Carrera Connected and when it made this, it made quite a big deal about it being a Swiss-made smartwatch. Now, is that just lip service or is this really a Swiss-made watch? Well, we're here to tell you that yes, this is way beyond any other smartwatch that you'll see or understand how it's built. To do that, I've got another one down here just to show you the intricacies. Um, we've got a full round display on the, career, the connected modular 45. There's no little flat tire part at the bottom. And there's, this was a technical challenge when Tag Heuer built uh, the watch. You see where it says Swiss made just here. Well, that is where much of the, uh, the electronics that would normally be in the flat tire section have been moved to and it's been made into a design feature. So you have this section here, mirrored the section here at the top. This time, it's a completely metal body, a titanium body. And if you remember on the Carrera Connected, it was a plastic section underneath. So how on earth do you get a metal bodied watch to have Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, NFC, GPS, which is inside here? Well. This was a massive technical challenge. I don't know if you can see on the video here, but there is two sections to the display here. There's a part at the top and a part underneath. Well, this sandwiched together second section is where all of the sensors breathe. So that's where you're gonna get your GPS reception, your Wi-Fi reception and everything else. Now, it was a technical challenge to get this there, but it's worked out really well, not just in terms of design, but also functionality. The connected modular 45 has a 70% increase in Wi-Fi connectivity and uh, reliability because of this sandwich section here. That's pretty cool. The screen, that's covered in sapphire crystal. And not just a little thin bit of sapphire crystal, this is a 2.5 millimeter thick piece of sapphire crystal. And the reason for that is Tag wanted depth to the image. They didn't want the screen to be up on the top of the glass like you'd see on a smartphone or any other Android Wear watch. They wanted it to be underneath the display, an important differentiating feature for a smartwatch. And of course, with a sapphire crystal screen, you get scratch resistance. The watch is also water resistant to 50 meters. And this titanium body is super durable. One of the key new features of the new Tag Heuer watch is its modularity. And we're going to have a look at how that works now. Modular as in smartphones is means taking things apart and putting them back together with new components. And funny enough, that's exactly what you do here. So Frederick from Intel is going to show us how that works. So take apart that Tag Heuer watch for me, please. Yes, no problem. So what we're gonna do is that we're going to replace the main module with a mechanical one, and we'll also replace the horns with another set of horns that are also available in this collection. Okay. And it's, and it's very easy, right? So all you need to do is to press this little button in the back, 
and snap down. Okay. Same thing on the other side. You have this little button right here. I don't know if you see it. It has a little arrow on it. Yeah. So you press it down, and then you pull it. And okay. That, that, how easy it is. Then you're left with the strap, and then for the horns, what you need to do is to pull them outwards, like this. We're gonna grab this caliber five module, which is right. a mechanical one. Which so is the, that is separate to the watch you buy. You buy your uh, buy connected, connected version, one. yes, and, and then, then you buy a mechanical watch Absolutely. body separately yes. separately and then you can swap it in uh it's it's of course compatible with your watch so it's easier to do it looking at the bottom but then all you need to do is to clip it back in same thing on the other side and in a matter of a minute you have <laughs> you have a mechanical, a mechanical watch. watch all of this technology and all of the amazing build quality that's inside the new Tag Heuer connected watch means it's not cheap. You're going to spend at least $1,600 for one of these. And if you want one with a super special movement, it comes in a pack with other bodies and other accessories, you could pay $17,000 for one of these. Not cheap, but this is pretty much as close as you can get right now to a proper Swiss made smartwatch. And that's quite an achievement. You can read more about this pretty spectacular smartwatch on Digital Trends right now.